If you have an existing solar electric system and you want to add a battery or a generator to it, how complicated that's going to be depends a little bit on the type of system that you have. Adding a battery to an existing solar electric system usually means AC coupling a new inverter and the batteries into your system. And it's really important to make sure that the new system is going to operate with the old system to ensure that the batteries won't be overcharged when the utility grid is not available and to make sure that the system doesn't go offline when it's off grid if the, ba if the batteries are fully discharged. So making sure those two pieces of the system are compatible is really important. These days, adding batteries to an existing solar electric system is very common. So many installers know how to do it and there's a couple of different approaches and techniques we can take to do that. Adding a generator to a house that has an existing solar electric system is also relatively easy. The things that we want to make sure when we're adding a generator to a system or installing a solar electric system in a house with a generator is we want the solar electric system to be on the utility side of the generator transfer switch. Every generator has a transfer switch and that's the device that disconnects the house from the utility when the utility grid goes down. Some of them are manual, there's an actual physical switch you need to operate, some of them are automatic. But the important thing is to make sure the solar electric is on the utility side of that transfer switch. What will happen if it's not on the utility side is if the generator is good enough to simulate a utility grid, the solar electric system will come online and any energy it generates has to go somewhere. So if it's producing more power than what the appliances in the house need, it's gonna send that power back to the generator and it may cause damage to the generator. Now, if you have a system that has batteries, that's kind of a different conversation because there's different ways to integrate a generator into a battery-based solar electric system. And it really depends on the equipment that you have in that system and how it's installed. So you really need to have someone who's an expert in those battery systems to be able to tell you how to integrate that generator for safety and to make sure it will operate properly.